Hi. Uh, Ray here with Life in Chiang Rai. I'm talking to Rudy, a long-time resident of Chiang Rai. And, uh, I mean, I've been here 12 years, but Rudy's been here how long, Almost, Rudy? almost 29 years. 29 years. Yeah. And uh, why have you stayed so long? Where you have to go? I'm Dutch. I don't go back to uh, to Holland to live there. Holidays, okay. I have friends in America. I visit sometimes my friends in America. Yeah, but I like it here. Now I met you what twelve years ago. I think so, yeah. About. And then you were you were exporting timber or something from Malaysia. Yeah. You're still doing that? No. No. It's dead. It's over dead. and out. Over and out with the timber from Malaysia, from Indonesia. Can we get it? Can we get it? Right. Yeah. So when did that stop? Oh, when we met each other. I think uh, almost the same time. Oh. Although it was only a few years. Oh, right. Only a few years. But uh, and then I started uh, to do something with the uh, motorbike group. I had my own uh, motorbike club, Road Eagles. It's done already. I did it for I was president for ten years, and then uh, another guy he took it over, and now I try to make fun. I have a friend club, independent riders. Everybody is welcome. Also, people who belong to a club, they can join us also. I have my uh, my uh, my line uh, account, and if I want to have a ride, I put it on the line. And people who want to join us, they can come. Most people like to go in the mountains. Because yeah, you've got some beautiful bike riding country here, don't you? Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. We've been everywhere, everywhere on the bike. Um, whole Thailand, until the deep south, we've been there also. It's nice. And I remember sometime in the past you were planning a ride to Kunming, China. Did that ever happen? No. 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 It was too much trouble with the paperwork and uh, the bikes to get it over the border and uh, no. Yeah. That's pity. That's pity. Yeah. Yeah, it would have been good. I went on the bike, not, not, not on the bike, by car to uh, Burma. That was nice. We, we went to visit the sawmill there. Uh -huh. They said, I'm a flung, I cannot go into the sawmill because, of, because I was flung. Oh, right. Yeah. And then we went back. Okay. Yeah. So, so, what do you do with yourself every day? So you do, Bor. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. That's why I'm doing this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I have a couple of good friends. Every morning we have a coffee in the coffee shop on the job. And mostly in the afternoon hey, we have a drink by the yellow flower, what I want to tell you before, or the Irish pet. Yeah. And that's all. Hmm. And. Uh, now we want to make more rice now, yeah, because many people, yeah, many people go back to their own country and they're coming back again, but when, I don't know, yeah, some people work abroad, they come and they, come and they go, yeah, but we have a, a, a group of, say, six people, they always go with us, yeah, they are a fast group, they can go, Fast as, as they want. They have sport bikes. I don't have a sport bike in the world because of my food. But uh, uh, people who want to go with us, they can uh, uh, ride their own speed. Uh -huh. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah. So you so you don't necessarily ride as a group. You just kind of at your own pace. Yeah, but okay. Uh, we, Hi. Um, we have a plan. I make a plan. Had, had the first day we go to here, the second day to there, and uh, have we stop there for lunch? 
we come all, to, all together on, on the same place. Yeah? But there are people who say, okay, three o'clock, uh, uh, how, how long it takes to lunch? I say, three, three, hour, uh, three o'clock, we are ready. And then some people go alone home, or they take another way to go back home. Freedom. Freedom. Mm. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah, what I can do here. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. So, um, you're just kind of a bum. A what? You're just a kind of bum. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Would you ever leave Chiang Rai? For a long time, you mean? Yeah. No. 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 I know. I'm, I'm, I'm retired, where to go? I don't go back to Holland, because I wanted my daughter and my grandson there. And uh, my daughter is working, and then I go to Holland, she can uh, maybe four days uh, a day off. What if I don't go for four days to Holland? So, uh, uh, expensive for that. Yeah, and I told her also, I better come to Thailand. I can tell you also, I would have cheaper. Yeah. But there are many places in Thailand you could go. There's Chiang Mai and oh, Phuket. Oh, we've been, oh, we've been many times there. Phuket, Krabi. Why, why do you live here and not Chiang Mai? Here, the climate is better here. The people, I think, are better too, don't you? Yeah. 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 No, no, I, I, I've been in, in, in Songkla, uh, Yala, everywhere I've been in Thailand. Almost everywhere. I like here the most. It's beautiful here. Yeah. You think it's safe here? Yeah. 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 I can park my bike uh, beside the street with, with my helmet on. If, if, if I do it in Holland, in five minutes my helmet is gone. Yeah. I am. I. This, uh, yeah, I like it here. Because it's safe, is what you say. That's right. Yeah, the people are pretty nice too, aren't they? People are nice. Yeah, I, I am here over 29 years. I never had any problem here. Because it's respect from yeah. both sides. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I totally agree. Yeah. And you know, we, you know, through this COVID situation, I know a lot of businesses have been hurt, but our everyday lives haven't changed very much, have they? Yeah. It's been right. quite relaxed. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's relaxed here. Only one thing is uh, the traffic get worse and worse and worse here. Yeah, I'm afraid that's going to continue. Yeah, everywhere. everywhere that happens. Everywhere. That's one of the problems that Chiang Rai is going to have in the future, I think, is that some of these roads where people are parked on both sides yeah. and there's hardly room for two cars I to know. drive down the I middle. Know. I, know. I, I think they're gonna they're gonna have to say you can only park on one side or something before long. It'll be like London. Yeah, <laughs> I, I know, I know. Yeah, narrow streets. Yeah, but they, you know, we do need the people. Exactly. Uh, exactly. Exactly. Need the people. Uh, and then I go in city. Uh, I take my uh, my bike. More easy to handle it and all the kind of thing. Yeah. There's my life in uh, Chiang Rai. There's my life in Chiang Rai. Yeah, I understand. It's, uh, it's, uh, you know, for a tourist, well, and for us, really, there's many places that a person can go out there and sit by a waterfall or on a hiking trail or yeah. go for a ride on a bike or yeah. whatever yeah. they want to do. There's, there's plenty to do. A hot spring, go soak in the hot spring yeah. for a while. Yeah. But I've done all those things yeah. myself and, and also the temples. And they say, Oh, we have to go here and there. I've been there already. Yeah. I, I, I don't want to see it for the third or the second time uh, third time or whatever. No. No, uh, it's like a circus. You see one circus, you've seen them all. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well Rudy, it was a pleasure chatting with you. Yeah. It was a pleasure. And um, I hope you get better from your leg problem as soon as possible. I hope so. And if the uh, activities of the uh, 
front clip from our bike. Front clip. If it starts again, I'll let you know. Yeah, please do. Uh, we can make some videos where we are and uh, send it to you. Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah. That'd be great. I think, I think, I think a lot of people would be interested in seeing what happens on a bike ride. You know, the scenery. And the, yeah, the, right. You know, the, 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 it's just beautiful out there. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I have people tell me that they've ridden, they've ridden bikes all over the world, but this is the best place they've ever, they've ever gone for a ride. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's true, that's true. Yeah. Oh, but uh, Europe is also sharing, uh, it's sharing. beautiful. The Alps? It's a different beauty though, isn't it? You know, totally different. Yeah, totally different. The Alps are all white. Yeah. And here it's all green. California, uh, it's all brown. Yeah, it is actually, <laughs> yeah. It just depends on where you are. Yeah. But every place, I think, has its own natural beauty. Yeah. You, if you don't sit back and compare and just look at what it is. Yeah, you know? yeah. The only thing I miss here is uh, the cold weather, the snow. Oh, you miss that? Oh, yeah, I miss it. I must admit, I like the cold weather myself. Yeah, I love it. Except I didn't like it in Amsterdam when I had to run across the damn canals before oh. I froze to death. <laughs> exactly, right. yeah. But where I come from, the east part, nearby Germany, it's beautiful, yeah, beautiful. Yeah. And also in the winter time, if there is snow, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Fresh fallen snow is absolutely lovely. Yeah, it's nice, it's nice. Okay, well we're going to say goodbye. Yeah, goodbye and, uh, anyway. Good, good to see you, buddy. And I hope we can do in the future more, more things. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that would be great. I'll let you know. That would be wonderful.